Alright, so a lot of people have asked me how to make this thing. This is what we call a ghillie suit, which is the uh, master of camouflage, basically. It's the best suit you can have for camouflage. Um, camouflage only, you know. I'm not going to say it's the best suit ever for militant or um, pseudo-military, paramilitary action. It's not the best for that, but it's the best for camouflage. You know, of course, different outfits and different attires for different things. But this is the best thing you can have for camouflage, and camouflage only. Alright, this, this suit, as you can see, is made out of different, um, like, stuff like twine and stuff like that. Aside from this fluffy stuff, which you can buy at your local Joann's or whatever, fabrics, you can also get uh, this twine stuff like this, and I'll be teaching you how to... Well, I'll be listing some stories you can buy that, and I'll also be showing you where. As far as the pants, um, pretty low budget here. I actually got these from Walmart. I believe these are Wrangler pants or whatever the hell they call them. And uh, this is just a regular old Faded Glory t-shirt that's army camo. So it's very cheap budget. Of course, if you want something that won't rot, then... You might want to go for something more expensive, like 5'11", or something like that. But, uh, this is your basic, um, cheap ghillie suit that's going to be extremely cheap to make. First thing you're going to need is you're going to need mesh, like this, mesh like this, fabric mesh, and you're going to need a lot of it. This is actually army camo if you look at it very closely, so it worked perfectly for me. But any green mesh is going to work perfectly, so if you get a lot of it, you're fine. And now, the part of making it. I'm really not sure. It, it really varies how you want to make it. Um, how I made it here is I actually got the belt loop and I actually tied the thing to it. And then I cut holes inside the um, bottom of the suit, of course. This is a two-piece suit of, of a ghillie suit. And I actually tied the belt loop and then I cut holes inside the pants. Very small holes. And then I tied the mesh to it. So, of course, what you want to do, though, is you want to tie actual strands of different things to the mesh to make a nice ghillie suit. So, that's how, that's how you do it. Oh, yes, and as a bonus, I forgot to mention, if you want to make a hat, because if you crouch, crouch down with it on and you don't want to be seen, your face will get in the way of that. So, if you want a hat... And all you really have to do is get the mesh and uh, do the same, the same principle applies with one of these. You know, this is one of those reversible ones, so if you're looking for desert camo, you can reverse it like this and all of a sudden you got a desert camo sort of feel. But uh, if, if, I do, if I do one, I'm probably going to do it with this sort of feel because I live in a woodland sort of area. So uh, that's, that's about it. Just wanted to make this video about my simple way of making a ghillie suit. So. That's it.